to make sure that it doesn't say Chef Live because that was the last thing it streamed. All right, looks like we're good. It looks like it says Hogwarts. Yeah, sometimes I still have that problem. But all right, well, I tried to stream close to around 11.30 as I could and this is my best time in a while. Right now it's like 11.40. So that's good for me. Hold on. Um, but last time we left off, we had to do like a little quest with Natty. They wanted me to go find her. No, not find her, but uh, we were talking and then it, le it led to me going to find her and whatnot, pretty much. But uh, I think we're getting close to the end. I would think so. Oh, well, knowing me, I like to do all these side quests. Oh, I pulled this. Okay. Matthew must have been taken this way. I need to find out quickly. Okay, there's people up ahead, so I need to do this. Probably that one later. Better be sure I'm not seen. Revelio. Really? God, wait, that's one thing I hate about this game. Dude. They spawn gear all over a place just so you have no inventory for it. I'm alive. Oh, she's facing Revelio. <laughs> Just keep an eye out. Keep on your toes. Stay a <laughs> Damn it, didn't do it. Oh, fuck sakes. Can I reload my save? That was some bogus shit, guys. That's some bogus shit, and you guys know that. That's it said it is, and it say petrify or whatever, until it was too late, until they already fucking turn around. Let's be sure I'm not seen. Don't interrupt me. Mind yourself. Let's finish this job and be done with it. Waste of time, this is. Share and share alike, say I. God so damn, bro. I got this maxed out, and he can I spot me from over the all the way. I'll tell you that. He'll turn on us first chance he gets. It's been a bit grim, I won't deny, but the tides will turn for us. I wouldn't go back to pit upon Ford if they was giving out galleons. <laughs> <laughs> Bro, are you kidding me? It This guy is taking his
Oh, I'm only empty on my gear slots. I gotta turn this up now because it's way too quiet. Destroy these. I don't know how I even have 24 gear to begin with. I could have just snuck up on him and did the little sneak kill, but oh well. Alright, there's... Okay, it looks like I might have found one of the optional things on accident. Let me check. I think I did. Okay, yeah, I found the optional... I found one of the optional Okay, so there was a secret way to go. Or there is, my bad. Alright, so I could just knock around. I didn't have to kill all those guys. Alright, I'm gonna go back over here and sneak. I'm gonna try. We should speak to her again. Perhaps she'll tell us where we can find that friend of hers. Ah, she's determined to say nothing. The boss will deal with her when he arrives. I felt it warranted more than a piece of meat pie. I couldn't. Really, bro? See what I mean? I collected two things and the same my gear is full. I collected an undefined item and I collected like a little fucking rope thing. So how is it full, my guy? Wait, shit don't make- shit don't add up at all. So I didn't find that okay. other optional thing, it looks like.
You best stand back. One never knows how a curse will react to being broken. Thank you, Mr. Isko. My pleasure. And thank you, my friend. We owe our lives to your bravery. I may be too weak to disapparate with you both, but I can try. You go ahead. Find Officer Singer. We will get out of here on our own. Very well. But be careful. Thank you, my young friend. Be prepared for a fight. These Ashwinders must pay. How about we sneak out and or try to? Let's find Officer Singer and put an end to Harlow. What Nuts I own I. I should have known. And you, the troll dispatcher. Oh, thank goodness the two of you are safe. Isco Rabe told me a couple of students had rescued him. Actually, Officer Singer, Natty and I learned of several Hogsmeade residents who've had their lives threatened by the Ashbinders. In addition to abducting Mr. Rabe, to blackmail his wife and Natty, Rookwood and Harlow have also extorted Agabus Filbert and Otto Dibble. Uh, I will look into all of that. As for the two of you, I appreciate what you're trying to do, but you are taking great risk. Next time, please let the authorities handle the Ashwinders. The authorities haven't done much about any of this. There's more to taking down an organization like the Ashwinders than simply storming in and hauling them off based on a few accusations. I must insist that you leave them to us. We shall have no further discussion on this. Natsai, you may wish to speak with your mother about this before I do. My mother will not like this. Thank you again for rescuing me. We shall speak soon. Okay, so that was that quest. Hey, we leveled up. Really?
All right, all right. Let's see what we want to do now. That took 40 minutes alone. Like, come on. Not 40, 20 minutes, my bad. Bro, why is my shit in, like, Spanish all the time? I don't get it. I text more English than Spanish. <laughs> Oh, is that because they took the blur off? Kind of looks weird. What the fuck? Oh, okay, I think I see. Okay, okay. Got some weird looking titties. So I'm probably gonna do this. Oh, it's the third keeper trial. Damn. Or how about let's do this one. Meet her, <clears throat> her in the forest real quick. We'll probably do both of these though. I'm glad today's Friday. We're ready for this weekend, for real. This is probably one of the worst birthdays I had in a while. Not gonna lie. I wish I could have went somewhere like my last birthday. I went to Los Angeles for for four days, I think. Yeah, it was four days. I wish I could have went somewhere, but we had to go on shutdown, on paid shutdown for two weeks, so it pushed me back on bills and everything, so I couldn't really go nowhere, you know. Is what it is. I can do this. I can do this. They will want to help. Is this where we're meeting the centaurs? Well, they don't exactly know we're coming, so it's less of a meeting and more of a surprise, I suppose. I'm not sure about this. I can't imagine they're fond of being surprised. We don't have a choice if we want to help the Snidgets. Perhaps they'll be able to tell that we're sincere? There's something about them that's so knowing. It's almost unnerving. I suppose they are known for having an air of omniscience. That's exactly the right word. I just... never mind. What is it? It's nothing, truly. I've... we've no secrets to hide. Speaking of secrets, I do want to tell you why Victor Rookwood's after me. He's working with Ranrock, and Ranrock's after something I found at Gringotts. Fig had a porky that led us there after the dragon attack. I... It's a bit of a long story, and Fig's asked that I not speak of it yet. Goodness. Well, that certainly helps explain a bit about what we saw back at Horntail Hall. Of course, I'll guard your secret as if it were my own. Even the centaurs won't know. We'll simply be honest with them about what we're trying to do. They'll have to help us, won't they? Yes, of course. You're absolutely right. We'll meet with them, tell them about the Snidgets, and I'm sure to all be fu-
What do you think you're doing here, humans? Please. Suppose you'd like a tale for your friends of the time you spoke to a centaur and... No, never. We're here because we need your help. Enough! You made a grave error in judgment in coming here, little witch. Leave them be, Alec. We do not harm the young. It is not our way. You forget your place, old fool. I'm the leader of this herd, and while you cling to our way, their kind continue to slaughter beasts like us without a care! From what I can see, they have slaughtered no one. They will leave here unharmed. Mark my words, Doran. If I ever see them again, it will be all three of your heads. <laughs> Foolish children. Do you know what happens to wizards who wander here? Now. Follow me Golden I... Sigets are still alive, and the poachers are after them. They know that the key to finding them lies in the moonlight, but they don't know what that means, yet. Please, help us find the Snidgets before the poachers do. Could it be? In the south, there is a cave within which lies what the poachers seek, a moonstone. Retrieve it and place it in the henge in the forest. I, on the other hand, must go speak with the herd. Find me after you have done this. I don't understand. So the moonlight mentioned in the journal doesn't refer to actual moonlight, but to a moonstone. What do moonstones have to do with snidgets? And why was he so certain about where we could find one? Isn't moonstone all around us? Why retrieve one from a cave? Knowing centaurs, I suspect he's referring to a specific moonstone. We'll likely know it when we see it. I don't know, but I am inclined to believe him, what with his being a centaur and all. I am too. It is a shame how quickly he left. What was his name? Doran. That's what the leader of the herd called him. Well, if Doran knows something we don't, I'd rather act now and ask questions later. I can head to the library and start looking into the cave he mentioned. I'll let you know what I find. So this one was just a, a chat mission for now. Alright. Do I not have a... Really? I have anything equipped. D sixty. All right, I'm going to go then fire this um, piece of gear. Then we'll go Hogsmeade, sell it, and then I'm gonna go do the main quest from there. Actually, hold on. Let me do the opposite, actually. Let's go Hogsmeade first.
Let me know if you need help finding anything. Let's see what you got for me. Kind of like that. I'd say that looks as if it was made for you. Ooh, I kind of like it. Like it. Oh, I definitely don't need this one. Yeah, I'll use that. I suspect you have a sharp eye for fashion. Be sure to stop by whenever you're about. Alright, now we go to Hogwarts. Go and defy that piece of gear and, and go do the main quest. Hopefully this main quest don't take until the time I gotta take a shower. Most likely will. Really? It was just another pair of those same goggles I just literally sold. It looks like it it's better like uh better numbers. I don't know what to call the numbers. Oh, okay. Yeah, let's do this. Bro, why does it look like I have eyeliner on? You see that? It's just his eyelashes, but it looks like I got like fucking. Bro, it looks like I got woman lashes on right now, dog. And look how long they are. Why they gotta be that long for? What the fuck? God damn, he's a fly away with those things. Kinda like that one. Yeah, let's do the mask. I just wanna cover up my face for now. I hate looking at those long ass eyelashes. I got a new mask. It's a wolf mask.
Oh, okay. start using that then say less those kill him instantly too what are you talking over there for I'm petting you don't worry stop talking so much what I'm so petting you who told you to wake up anyway Alright, I'll probably save the rest of them. Let me check. Alright, Felix, you need to drink some water, my guy. Your nose is too dry. Can I play my game now? Mister, I do this every morning and not at night. I come home at 11. I stay up till 2. So he has 3 hours every night to do this. That's the next steps in our plan to stop Harlow. Where's this taking me? Is that main quest or side quest? Let me check. I'm just curious. Okay, it's a side. Poppy should send me an owl soon too. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Hey, dude, what's that for, bro? Bro, I just witnessed a fucking murder, dude. <laughs> Alrighty then. Rebellion. Interesting. Very interesting. What is that? Rebellion. Oh, there's a ghost. Look at him. He waved at me. Oh, here's a lock on this door. Why is there a lock down there? I mean, I can easily get down there. I have no idea where this is taking me. Rebellion. Oh yeah, I never f did figure out what these are for. I seen them around. These right here, yeah. I never did figure out what they're for.
Bro, where am I at, dude? Like, where is this shit taking me? I think there's a moonstone in there. Hello, yeah, there boy. is. Now that I get it. Sweet, I can. Not bad. What's in here? What? There's so much shit to explore. I don't even know where the fuck I'm at right now. I've never been to this area of Hogwarts. Oh, it's a toad thing. That's what that's for? I'm cool then. There's another one of these. Oh, okay, it looks like the Toad Dane spits you out right there. Are we almost there yet? It took me across like fucking the United States and shit, bro. Yeah, I think that's. Hold on, is that what I want? I already opened it? Oh, I already opened it, okay. So I have been in this area. Or maybe it was just opened. I don't know. We will never know. Okay, yeah, never mind. I, okay. I was like, where the fuck am I at, bro? <laughs> There was no way of fast travel here? I'm sure there was. I, I'm just lacking. Hello, Professor. I have news. The goblins are looking for something. Another repository. Oh, I they just shit drills myself. to help with their search. <sighs> Most troubling. Are these repositories like the broken container I found at Rookwood Castle? They are. I fear we have no time to lose. Have a look at the map. Fortunately, the next try is very nearby. It's Hogwarts. As you know, I was headmistress in my time. My portrait hangs in the headmaster's office. In fact, I witnessed Professor Black learn of your arrival. And I'll confess that I wondered about you. Wait, is the next trial in the headmaster's office? It is. I had hoped that when the time came, the occupant of that office would be of help to us. Unfortunately, this headmaster seems wildly unconcerned with anything but himself. You'll need to access the office while he's away. I understand. Very well. I'll find some way to get in. Good. I shall meet you in my portrait there. Until then. <clears throat> yeah, this day's gonna suck, dude. I just opened my pack of gushers. Tropical gushers. And... It looks like all of it is orange, but two of them. Oh my god, I hate my life!
Pig will know what to do. Revelio. I now, Demi guys. I haven't even tried collecting all of them, even though they unlock some good stuff. Professor Fig, the keepers have shown me where the next trial is. Has something changed? Lord Gok and I have learned that the goblins are searching for another repository, like the one we saw at Rookwood Castle. And I discovered that they're building massive drills to help in their search. Professor Fitzgerald seemed very concerned. I see. Ranrock clearly knows even more than we suspected. And, sir, there's something else. Lord Gok knew Miriam. He knew Miriam? They encountered each other at Rookwood Castle. She was doing research. That's where she found the container with the port key. He liked her so much that he let her leave with it, despite orders from Ranrock. I don't know what to say. She could win over almost anyone. I want to hear more of this. And, in fact, I'd like to speak with Lodgok directly. But we've no time now. Where is the next trial? Believe it or not, it's in the headmaster's office. Incredible. All right. You'll need the password to get past the stone gargoyle. The headmaster's house elf will know it. I've actually met Scrope, but I'm not sure he'll tell me. He's rather devoted to the Black family. He is. So you'll need a disguise. I have just the thing. A polyjuice potion. You'll look and sound like Professor Black. Wait, doesn't polyjuice potion require a bit of the person you want to change into? And take ages to brew? It does. So, how do you already have Polyjuice Potion to change into Professor Black? One never knows when such a thing may come in handy. Let's just say I felt the need to be prepared for anything after my fruitless trip to the Ministry on his behalf. Now, time is of the essence. Drink up and I shall explain more. That is pretty sus, I won't lie. <laughs> <laughs> Oh. 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 Hmm. How do you feel? Uh, incredible. I won't forget that taste anytime soon. <clears throat> How do I sound? Convincing. I've taken the liberty of transfiguring your robes. As we discussed, you'll need the password from Scrope, who could be anywhere in the castle. You might look for Professor Kagawa. She's taken to badgering the poor elf about Quidditch in the hopes that he can convince Black to change his mind. Thus far, unsuccessfully. I see. But what if Professor Black sees me? Leave him to me. I shall tell him where to meet a liaison from the Ministry in Hogsmeade. That should give you plenty of time. Thank you, Professor. I suppose we'll meet again in the map chamber. It's rather strange to hear gratitude coming from Professor Black. <laughs> I'll see you there. Now to find the headmaster's house elf. This is interesting. Can we not fast travel? Okay, it looks like we might not be able to fast travel. Do you have a moment, Professor? Professor, 
I was hoping to catch you. I... Oh, I, um, places to be, Professor Sharp. Places to be. Of course, sir. Only, <clears throat> you'd asked me about a particular potion, and I... Well, I... I did? I did, yes. Well, spit it out, Sharp. I don't have all day. Probably best not to discuss it here, sir. I assure you, Sharp, you may speak freely. Very well. I've brewed the cure for boils you wanted. I can drop it by your office when it's convenient. <laughs> of course, yes. No need for all the cloak and dagger. Simply have a student deliver it. A student. Very well, sir, if you insist. I do. And thank you, Sharp. I just hope you've brewed enough for all my boils. <laughs> now, to determine which student gets this rather... If you must speak with me, consult my secretaries or what have you. Now move along. Uh, there was the Professor Fig. You call that a shine on those boots? Do better! Headmaster? Here, yeah. what could he want? Mr. Gaunt! Where do you think you're going? I beg your pardon, sir. I'm simply on my way outside. Taking the day off, eh? Typical student, wasting the hours away. I... I have to write 20 inches on Dittany, and its uses was heading to the greenhouse. Ah, yes! Mixed <coughs> with, uh, bubo tuba pus makes a, a fine, uh, mustache paste. Yes, mustache paste. What is he talking uh, about? <clears throat> Are you feeling all right, sir? You don't seem yourself. I assure you, I am quite healthy, Gaunt. If I need a medical diagnosis, I shall head to St. Mungo's. That was a little interesting. Something is very... <clears throat> I wonder almost daily why I accepted this appointment from the Ministry. Professor, a word? Professor Black? Again, it is not too late to reconsider your decision regarding Quidditch. We... we could still have trials and a somewhat shortened season. It would be better than none at all. But the injury, Madam Kogawa. Professor! More than one student has taken a bludger to the head on our pitch. I dare say it knocked some sense into them. And they are fine now. The fact that it happened to be a pure blood, well, that's no reason to... What nonsense! That you would trivialize the health of a student over a, a silly game. A silly game? I... You are quite impossible sometimes. Sir, I have a good mind to write to the Department of Magical Games and Sports at the Ministry about you. Good idea. I can even provide the parchment should you need it. Now, where is my elf? I... parchment? Very well, I will, and with pleasure. And I spotted Scrope in the Great Hall. Seems to be avoiding me. Hmm, I wonder why. Good day, Madam Kagawa. What did we do to deserve him as a headmaster? I haven't time for any of you at the moment. None. None at all. Move aside. Coming this way. Chewing with your mouth open? Where are your manners? Professor, I need to speak to you. 
Hello, Professor Black. Ah, Professor Weasley. How, how delightful to see you. Sir? Ah, uh, since I have you here, I wonder if I might, um, speak with you about Professor Fig. Oh, very well. I've decided to give him a bit more, uh, leeway with his time. Leeway, Professor? Are you sure that's wise? I confess I do worry for his students. He's rarely here as it is. I realize that, and I'd like to keep it that way. I see. But, sir, if I may, I am wary of how much time the new fifth year seems to be spending away from the castle, supposedly on Professor Fig's behalf. I've heard unsettling rumors of their escapades. Everything from sneaking into the Forbidden Forest to confronting Ranrock's loyalists and Rookwood's lot. Uh, what? <coughs> Goodness. You cannot believe everything you hear, Professor. No, 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 you cannot. Uh, <clears throat> I mean, I shall keep an eye on Fig. You simply keep doing the wonderful job that you're doing. <laughs> simply wonderful. I... well, I... Um, thank you. But I'm happy to look into... Uh, good, good. That'll be all, Weasley. I, I mean, Professor Weasley. Good day. A wonderful... Felix is up my ass again. Won't leave me alone. That ought to give Professor Fig some breathing room. Attention, students! I hereby decree that the Great Hall be forthwith decorated in the stunning banners of Slytherin. I shall be taking no questions at this time, or ever. Oh, wow. Huh. Interesting. Scrope! Oh, greetings, Master. Remind me of the password to my office. Oh, but Master made Scrope swear never to tell anyone. Even Master himself. How dare you question me? I've a mind to give you a matching set of ears. Uh, uh yes, sir. Uh, of course, sir. Uh, Scrope begs forgiveness. It is the Black Family motto, Master. Hmm. Right. Of course. I, uh... Master does remember it. Oh, shit, bro. I don't know. <laughs> does it matter if I get this wrong? 
Of course I remember. It's the Black Family Reigns. Is Master giving Scrope a test? It's pure bloods forever, isn't it? Uh, close, Master. Uh, Scrope thinks Master is indeed testing Scrope. It is always pure. <laughs> Obviously. And, of course, as Master knows, in French. Ah, yes, of course. Uh, I order you to pronounce it for me. Oh, Master knows that Scrope's French is most pitiful. <laughs> oh, very well. Uh, toujours pure. Uh, there is another matter, Scrope. I confiscated this filthy diary from a student. It smells of squid and seawater. Oh, Apollonia's diary. <clears throat> that is quite a surprise, Master. What do you wish Scrope to do with this treasure? Uh, uh, rubbish. <laughs> Whatever you wish, Scrope. It's your treasure. Now, off with you. <clears throat> the Polyjuice potion's wearing off. I best get out of sight. Fig was right. That's just I can't believe it worked. Now to speak the password to the gargoyle. Hello, Hamora. Was that the quest? I think it was. Okay, so now we need to go to the office. All right. Are you stuck? You look stuck over there. You need help? I think he needs help. One second. Oh, where am I even at? Okay, there's some behind there. Oh, through here. Okay. Handy resource indeed. Your field guide. Is it above me? Oh wow! I even know there's one right here. Oh, three lock. Look at that. Is there anything important in here?
Revelio. Oh, say was that it? Yes, I told you. You're very clever. clever. Rebellion. A lot of stairs to go up. Damn, it's all the way up here. So this is my oh office. I'll be pissed. Fast travel here. Big ass chest. Revelio. Dude, where's this office at? Oh my goodness. I'll be mad if this was my office. I'll be like, why am I all the way up here? The fuck? Looks like I might need The gargoyle. That's where I need to speak the password. There's one of those fly things. Rebellion. Fuck, I forget the password. Toujours pure. Okay, I was about to look it up just in case it may like question me or something. I wonder if all the elite wizarding families have a motto. Revelio. Oh, the hat. Look at that. He's big posted in here. It's good, good to see you. you. All thanks to Professor Fig's quick thinking. <coughs> now what? Approach the pedestal in the antechamber and read the book that appears. I suspect there will be more to this than reading a book. Your suspicions are correct. We shall speak when you are finished. Has this been under the headmaster's nose all this time? Rebellion. That 
must be the pedestal. Something's gonna go down. Did we just go in the book? What? What happened? Where am I? Professor Fitzgerald? Can you hear me? I am here. In this place, you may call me Leave. You shall be witness to a fable. Pay attention. Things are not always as they seem. You must move swiftly and cautiously. Use the tools you encounter to find me. The uh, first you will need is a cloak. This is interesting. I got no powers. I don't think I do. In this Not place, yet. As in life, death takes many forms. Avoid each of them at all costs. Is this the Deathly Hollows? Is this what this is? Death Shadow. So I don't got no powers, I just need to be stealthy, which I hate being stealthy. Is he not gonna move? Is, is he just gonna sit there? I need to time this just right. Okay. Oh, come on. I hate stealth, I really do. Anything to do with stealth is just not my forte. I best move while I can. Move must be this somewhere. I need to tell you just invisible? right. I probably could have went right there. Bro, come on. I see a staircase straight ahead. I don't know nothing about Harry Potter, so I'm sorry, guys. I'm sorry if this makes you a little upset. But I'm guessing this is the Deathly Hollows. I don't know nothing about it, but... Why does every time I take a screenshot, the audio messes up? It's really odd. Ladder. Perhaps they won't be able to find me if I go up there. Okay, why are we just sitting here? Move. Move. Like, why are we just sitting here? They got a dog too now? What the fuck? They 
gone. For now, I need to get out of here. Where could she be? Too many. I must cross this road as fast as I can. Where am I supposed to go? That's where I need to go, but I need to find a way past them. <clears throat> There's death. So Nothing this way, but more danger. There must be another way to find you. It's just the inquiry. I need to turn back. There's no getting past them that way. That doorway looks like the only safe way forward. What is this? Like, what are you guys even searching for? Now's my chance. Thanks for telling me, because I don't think I would have won it otherwise. That's the way oh, there's a cloak. Sweet. Is this an invisible cloak? I think I'm invisible. Okay, looks like we need to go this way. Okay. Can I get past them easier now? They can't see me at all. I can get closer to them. This is the way forward. Finally free. Now where are you, Neve? Okay, so I can't change the powers I have. Okay. I like this little class, it's pretty dope. What the fuck is that? Complete the battle one time. Defender.
Descender. The pulse. That's pretty easy. I need to learn that Bombarda one. I got the quest to do so, I just haven't done that yet. I got face him or something. Defender. Oh, it's a troll. Oh, yeah, he's a lot of Heal, bro. Every time I heal, it's like, damn. Like, look. Oh, what's the last on that, buddy? Descender, bombarder, defender, the pulse, descender. Dude, he's taking lots of damage. I can't even see his health bar because my Dane's in the way. We got for me now. Let's face you and me. Pussy. Pushy. Pushy. I should go pushy. You guys gotta hear me spamming, I'm sorry, like in advance. There's a, this game is throwing a lot at me right now. I, I wasn't expecting all this. Like, for real, this is crazy. What did I say? Did not kill him? Okay, then. Alright, let's chill on that. Dude, this 
guy can take a hit. Oh my god. Like for real, this might be video. What am I hitting? Come on, bro. Hit him! I was hoping that was the end. I can't believe she's dead. Oh, poor Neve. Gods, let us always honor her. May her memory be a treasure to us forever. Hey, Death, what's up? You just chilling? Chilling like a man? <clears throat> You found me, but you cannot undo what has been done. The magic of the stone can only conjure a shadow of my former self. The last trial. Eliminate darkness does not always mean that you should. I could be wrong. Remember that as you witness my memory. No, why'd you stop moving? Dora, what you did for your father was remarkable, wasn't it? And Percival needn't worry about the strands of emotion or the traces that this magic leaves. I found a way to contain all of it. You haven't stopped. Goblin Silver. You spoke to a goblin about this. Don't worry, he has no idea what we're containing. We don't know what effect any of this may have. The emotions, the dark traits. You sound like Percival. And as it happens, I do know. It is a source of strength, of focus. Somehow it enhances my ability to wield magic. I don't follow, Isadora. I think we can harness it. Power like this is not to be toyed with in the wrong hands. You saw what I did for my father. Oh, Neev, imagine the good we could do. Everyone is in some kind of pain. Breathe it in. Oh, can you feel it? Oh, it's Adora. 
This must stop. All of us. You've kept this power to yourselves for so long because you fear it. I choose to embrace it. Interesting, okay. So she's gonna be the main villain, I take it. Cause she's in every memory. Like every memory we saw, she's in every single one. If the rumors are to be believed, you've taken to increasing the beast population. Is it true? Has someone completed the first three trials? Okay, so there's one more. I have. But you are so... Young? I know. You must be Professor Bacar. I am. Pleased to meet you. The pensive memory I just witnessed was Isadora inhaling painful emotions. She was. I found it disturbing. But how did she gain power from it? How did she harness it? It was disturbing. Although, I wonder that you are asking about her power. I hesitate to reveal the location of my pensive to someone who, perhaps, has yet to understand the responsibility of power. I can assure you, Professor, I do. In fact, what you don't yet know is that a dangerous goblin called Ranrock has accessed the repository at Rookwood Castle. He has learned to harness the contents of it as a source of immense power. <coughs> he plans to use that power against wizardkind. We have no time to waste. I see. Nonetheless, the knowledge you shall gain after you witness my memories is too valuable to share without further consideration. I shall require time to confer with the other Keepers. It seems we have no choice but to wait, frustrating as it is. I heard what you told Professor Bakar. Isadora was inhaling emotions to gain power? She was. And she pulled emotions, as she did from her father, from Professor Fitzgerald, without permission. Monstrous. What's more, she said that she found a way to store the traces of magic she extracted in goblin silver. The repositories? Possibly. There's something I didn't get a chance to tell you earlier. Ranrock has been digging at locations tied to the five names he found in the journals of a goblin metal worker named Bragball. Five names? The Keepers, and who else? Isadora Morganak? Rookwood Castle. If the Keepers won't tell you where the next trial is yet, I say we at least maintain a watch on Ranrock. Perhaps he'll lead us to more information. Perhaps. I hope to hear from Lord Gok soon. I haven't heard anything since I learned of the drills. Oh, and as you've probably guessed by now, your poly plan worked like a charm. I knew it would. I may have done too good a job distracting Black. I had no idea he can't hold his fire whiskey. <laughs> Alright, is that the end of the quest? Okay, yep. Yeah. Alright, I'm gonna wait for a few seconds, see if there's any, like, owl messages to come through real quick. I do have to get off though, it's 116. I shouldn't have reacted so bitterly about your goblin friend. I apologize. I hope we can finish what we started with the triptych. Please meet me at the southern coast. We can search for the final canvas piece. Okay, it looks like this quest is locked. It shows a locked icon on it. But yeah, I won't presume that was the Deathly Hollows to kind of look like it. Even though I don't know too much about all that stuff. Pretty sure it was though. So that's probably going to be the title of this video on my YouTube. Um, so if you want to check that out, that will probably be uploaded probably tomorrow. Yeah, most likely would be tomorrow because uh, I'm going to upload my Resident Evil video today. So yeah, I think it will be tomorrow. 
But yeah, uh, I tried to stream for as long as I could, and I think I did good today. At least it's over an hour. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed, and with that being said, I'll see y'all in the next one. Thanks for tuning in.